What's up everyone? Today we are going to be going through and finding what is in my cross country bag. So this is my cross country bag right here. First off, we'll start with these. So I have about five of these on here. Some of them are stickers. Like each PR I got, so this one's like 19 minutes and then on down like 18, 17 in that state. When I ran sick, 16, it got second. Put that on there. I'll be on there until I beat my PR, hopefully next year. But yeah, we'll go with the side pocket. That's so over here. You know, cross country runners are running three miles, right? And you're gonna get blisters. So I got some tape. Uh, yeah, it's just, you're gonna get blisters no matter what, really. No matter what shoes you wear. Um, stay hydrated, gotta have water on the side. You run three miles, you're gonna sweat you're gonna sweat a lot of water out. So might as well have that. We'll go front pocket. This one may be a surprise you guys. I don't know if you runners out there know who Nick Simmons is and what company he has, but he has his run gum. Alright, I got packs of run gum in here. It's Two of these, there's two pieces in here. Two of them are equivalent to a coffee or a Red Bull. One of them's equivalent to a uh, Coke, but there's really no sugar. One gram of sugar, 50 gram, 50 milligrams of caffeine, zero calories, so it's nothing really. You throw it in you. One one day I took this, my one conference, I took it, I couldn't sleep that night. I don't know if it was because my adrenaline was pumping because I won, but I had this. I had around 500, 500 milligrams of caffeine before that race, so I was pumping. <laughs> so yeah, I got that. Now we're going to the big boy, all right? Hold on. Oh yeah, ready? Usually, I have this in my bag. So like I said, you run three miles, you're going to get sore. You got to roll it out, you got to take care of yourself. This is a really, really good one. It's a really expensive one. You don't got to buy a really expensive one, but I trust, trust me, you out here rolling out, it's going to help you. Right now I'm dealing with a hip problem. I use this almost every day, if not one of my foam rollers, but my foam roller don't fit in my bag. This does. Um, like I said, got a band. You stretch yourself out. Got a knot in it right now. But you stretch yourself out. You wrap around your foot, stretch yourself out. These are also major key when you're sore, right before a race. And then you got my jersey. I'll show you guys my jersey. I'll show you guys an all state runner jersey. Right here. Bam. Check that out. That's a nice jersey. Got the back. It says Muskie, says my team on the back. Yeah. They'll be changing up next year, though. That's fine with me. And then, I know a lot of people make fun of these, but you got your short shorts. I like to roll mine, so they're about this big on me. Trust me. You don't see, you, you see a lot, but when you're, run, when you're out there running, the lightweightness of it actually helps you run. You guys didn't know that. Um, let's see what else I got in here. Once again, Staying hydrated. Ugh. Water. You never know when you're gonna need water. Right here. Major key alert. So during the cross country season, it's sometimes rainy, right? Um, when we get to cross country meets, we like to walk the course. And when the courses are out through timbers and stuff, and your feet usually get wet. So when they're when your feet get wet. You're running either in wet socks, or you can prepare and you bring an extra pair of socks. One day, I was, we were out uh, walking the course, and my feet got wet, so I changed over, right? I brought like three pairs of socks, I knew it was wet. And then, we had to walk across this lot to get to the starting line. Feet got wet again, so as soon as we got the starting line, I changed into this before we stretched out. But yeah, those are also major key. Uh... Yeah, see, I got another pair in here, just so you guys believe me. Right here, I think this might. Yeah, if you guys didn't believe me, I went to state. Right there. State. 
Missouri State High School Activities Association, Columbia, Missouri. So there's proof right there I went to state. Um, yeah, I'm using my dad, which is a coach, throws this in my bag for some reason. So, using like our letters, like this stuff right here, our letters. Now time for the big boys. So last year, I ran in regular running shoes, right? These regular old plain running shoes. Didn't really care, didn't really matter to me. But this year, after running 10 miles during the summer, working out a lot, Brain, we're losing all that weight as you guys can check in one of my videos. Go check it out right now and then come back and finish this video. But yeah, I really need a good pair of shoes and I know what to expect when they hear cross country cleats because during track you got spikes and they really hurt your calves when you're sprinting and stuff. So I ordered these and this is the greatest thing I've ever done. So I really, really, really encourage you guys if you run cross country to get you a pair of these adidas um cross country spikes they're like 60 bucks and literally one of the greatest things ever they have tons of support they're lightweight you can just chuck these things wherever and it don't really matter they're super lightweight they're like a regular shoe but then they got them bad boys on the bottom so when you're running you grip but yeah that's I really fell in love with these during the season, and trust me, next season, when I win state, make sure you guys are around for that post next year, but um, when I win state, I promise you I will be wearing a pair of these Adidas spikes. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce their name, some Spanish type thing, but it says Adidas Zero XC. So yeah, that. Adidas. I encourage you to cop a pair of these. But yeah, that is about it. My bag, it's a USA bag. I copped it from a Nike outlet. Nike outlet, yeah. Really, that's about it. Essentials, you gotta have stretch, water, and those amazing shoes. But that's what's in my cross country bag. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, hit the subscribe button down below. Hit the likes up button. See you guys next time. Peace out.